Did Judge Selna get it correct? Yesterday, I attended a sentencing hearing in Santa Ana to support a client who more than two years ago pled guilty to evading more than $3 million in taxes. Once he was caught, he pled guilty, paid back the three million bucks. Then there's the IRS civil penalty of 75% on the three million. He volunteered extensively. And during the sentencing hearing, he told Judge Selma, there should be consequences for my conduct. I've betrayed this country that gave me so much. Indeed, our client came here 40 years ago, homeless and poor and through hard work, built a business and family. Judge Selma said tax cases really bother him because it's easier to evade or camouflage. Unlike someone who embezzles $3 million, that loss would more quickly come up in an audit. Everyone knew, Judge Selma, the prosecutor, everyone in the courtroom knew our client would never return to a courtroom as another defendant. Yet because of the loss amount and the deterrence component, Judge Selma gave him six months in a minimum security camp. I'm biased, I know. I think it's a waste of taxpayer resources to warehouse this fine man in a minimum security camp.